Hello, and welcome to Casas Adobe's Congregational United Church of Christ, where we are practicing church without walls. And I am literally here in a place without walls in our St. Francis garden off of our children's education wing. And it's a place that not many of us get to, and so I thought I would uh, go ahead and do our welcome and Christ candle from here. So, we live into the words here, no matter who you are or where you are on your journey, you have a place here. You have a place in our community, and that's especially true right now as we practice church without walls. And so if you're in your living room or your bedroom, or if you just happen to be sitting outside on your porch, you have a place in God's community. I am Pastor John Angelo, and I'm the family and education minister here. And uh, later on in our service, you will see our senior pastor, Pastor Michael Bush, uh, who will be leading our worship today. So if you have a moment, um, explore our website, uh, check out the, the bulletin. There will be a bulletin uh, PDF off to the side that you can access. Um, if you are new to our community, please feel free to explore our website. And if you would like to uh, get more information, please email us or um, just <laughs> drop us a note. Somehow call us. All the information is on the website. We would love to get to know you. So today in our readings, we will see Jesus questioning the leaders of the day. Where do I get my authority from? Where do you get your authority from? And sometimes in religious circles, we get tied up in this idea, well, who is authorized to do what? I know in my early days, coming from a Roman Catholic tradition, that was very important to me. Who is authorizing this? Who is ordained for this? Who has a part to play in God's reign? And as I've come to embrace and understand the UCC, I've come to learn we are all authorized to be a part of God's kingdom. There is no one who is not a part. There is no one who is left out. And we all are authorized to take part and to proclaim the good news around the world and to our friends or hold it in our hearts. So today, as I light our Christ candle and we get a view of St. Francis in our children's garden, as I light it, I want to think want you to think about ways ways that you are authorized to proclaim God's reign ways that you have been authorized to be a part of God's church and this is our good news for today. Let us worship our God. Amen. <laughs> 